Let's get started. Today I want to see what Mikey is going to do. He told me he wants to do some kind of experiment. I'm interested to see what he's going to do. As we can see, they are building some kind of mechanism. It really looks strange. I want to solve all the problems as quickly as possible and get everything out as interestingly as possible. Look, it's really like he wants to turn into someone. It's incredibly interesting looking. Anyway, we'll just have to follow it up and draw some conclusions. I think Mikey is about to do something very strange. Mikey probably wants to turn into a furnace, but why would he want to do that? Whoa, guys, look at this. It's really happening. Mikey turned into a furnace. That's really weird because I thought it was forbidden. I mean, this is really unexpected for me. I need to follow Mikey and what he's going to do in that form. I'm really curious about it. Anyway, we'll talk to Mikey again, and I wonder why he didn't tell me anything about it. What? Why would he come into my house? Oh no, he blew it up. Why would you do that, Mikey? Ha ha ha, that was really, really cool. I totally blew up your house. I decided to prank you and I did it that way. I didn't expect Mikey to do that. He actually destroyed my house. I need to steal stuff from him. I mean, we're best friends and we have to share things like that all the time. I mean, that's how it works. I wanna solve all the problems as quickly as possible and just take a break from all these problems. The way I see it, that's really going to be very, very, very difficult. I just wanna find out what he has going on. Since Mikey destroyed my house, I have a much better plan. I'll just make sure I teleport inside Mikey's furnace and build a house inside. I've gathered everything I need to build a house there and of course survive the heat. I'm going to try to survive inside Mikey's furnace. It's going to be a really big challenge. Hey, what do you want? Stay away from me. I won't let you build a house inside me. I'll burn you down if I really have to. I'll teleport in, Mikey. All right, friends, we're inside Mikey's furnace. That was actually easier than I thought it would be. I have a prepared house that I can do inside Mikey himself. This is going to be unbelievably fun. Hey, don't you even dare build anything inside me, much less make anything. I didn't give you permission to do that. You completely destroyed my house, so I'm going to make another house inside you. I'll put a small house and use a potion to enlarge the house. It's going to be unbelievably cool. I told you not to do anything like that. What don't you understand? I'm going to start burning. Woohoo, folks, this is really getting dangerous. Mikey's really pissed off and starting to get hot. I really hope I can hold out and take all the heat that Mikey is going to give me. But it's just going to be unbelievably awesome. Great! My little house is finally big, and I can of course go in and start living here. This is incredibly cool, friends! My first order of business, of course, would be to just make myself a farmhouse inside Mikey's furnace. I'm sure that could be solved. So now, we're going to grab everything we need from the trunk and start making our farm somewhere in the back. I don't think there will be any problems with that. I'm hoping we can solve it very even quickly. You can't make a farm here. The water will evaporate instantly. It's going to be really, really hard. Mikey only scares me. I just need to try hard and do it. We'll see how it goes from here. It's getting hotter and hotter in here, so I'll have to cool down soon enough. I need a farm to provide food for a long time. I really hope I can make it work. Ha ha ha, you won't succeed. You can't do it. I'm answering your question right away, JJ. What? Is it true that the water evaporated in a second? That's just unbelievably awful. We have to just figure out how the water is supposed to get here as quickly as possible. I'm completely out of ideas. Oh no, friends, that's just awful. This much heat is starting to make my head burn. But since I don't have any water, we have to make some. We'll have to turn it with alchemy. I hope I can make water that I can actually put myself out in. That would be really, really cool. Anyway, it all needs to be tested to make it work properly. That's the whole problem with it. The longer we do all this stuff, the harder it gets. I want to solve all the problems as soon as possible now. Great! With the help of these potions, I was able to make myself some water that will definitely not go to waste. It will be the basis for my farm. It's going to be there all the time. It's going to be awesome! Let's try to put my head out. Maybe it will really help? Oh no! I guess this water won't help me at all. It's fake water. Anyway, I need to cool down as soon as possible. That's the only option I have. I have to put some really, really cold liquid down to make me feel better. Get off my furnace at once. I didn't authorize you to be there. I ruined your house because you're bad, JJ. 
You took all my cookies from me last time. I took them from you because you were fighting with the villagers, and now you've destroyed my house completely. I just have to put my head out because it's going to be unrealistically hard to work. I only have one main thing on my mind right now. I want to solve all the problems as fast as possible and build something incredibly cool. I'm going to kick you out of there sooner or later or burn you down. You can't build anything here. I'm going to build something here anyway, because I just don't have a better place for it. Then expect constant attacks. I'll do anything to destroy you and your house. I'll keep heating up my furnace to make it harder for you. Then you won't be able to escape me and you'll have to get out. Now that's really dangerous. Mikey is really mad and won't help me. He's only ruined it. Oh no, Mikey started setting things on fire. I need to put it all out as fast as possible. I don't want my house and my farm to burn down. We have to start putting it all out. I'll break the ice and of course spill the water. It's really gonna be very, very cool. Ha ha ha, I told you this would really work seriously. I'll be destroying you and your house. I won't give you a peaceful life here. Not until you get out of there yourself. I'll just burn everything. Mikey, come on, let me live here and just enjoy my new house. Stop messing it up. I want to get this over with as soon as possible and forget about all the problems. All right, folks, let's break the ice and spill the water. It's the easiest way to put out the fire around here. I really hope we can solve all the problems and start living life to the fullest here. I want to solve all the problems with Mikey. My house is going to be 100% here and I'm not going anywhere. I'm going to fight him to the very end. Sooner or later, you're going to have to get out of there because it's going to get incredibly hot in here. We'll see when I get really bad. I'll do my best to solve all the problems and see my house through to the end. I want to finish it. It's going to be a battle, friends. Friends, this is just awful. I have JJ inside of me trying to build a house. What? Villager, I'm not a simple furnace. Don't even think about using me. I've got to get out of here as fast as I can because he's gonna put his meat in me. I don't wanna cook his food. I just wanted to be an oven to help in completely different places. But apparently I'm going to have to do all that because he won't get off my back that easily. Don't you dare. That would really be a big problem for me because it's going to make it harder for me to work. The temperature will be higher. I'm trying to get away from this villager, but I can't. He's much faster than me. I guess I just have to give up and accept my situation. It's really just going to be awful. Hey, don't chase me. I don't want to become a furnace for someone else. It's just going to be really just awful. But the villager really wants to cook his meat in me. That just sounds horrible. Phew, I'm really tired of running. It's just going to be incredibly hard for me to do it all. Okay, let me help you one last time. You can lay out the meat and I'll cook it. Let's see how hard it's going to be, JJ. Because a whole other set of problems might come out at this point. Friends, this is a really big problem for me because the villager has started cooking his meat. When it is fried, all the bacteria will be destroyed from it. They will fall right down to me, which means I'll be fighting against monsters of different kinds. It will really be a challenge for me. And of course, when this meat is cooked, the temperature inside the furnace will be incredible. So I have to be very careful and cool myself down in time. This will really help me to fight. I need to prepare myself well before I fight against all these monsters. There can really be a lot of them. I'm going to need tactics on how I'm going to take them all down. They are already attacking and surrounding my house. I need to get my equipment and start fighting against them. But you have to be very careful because the iron armor can burn me because of this temperature. So I need to figure out how to cool myself down and fight against these monsters. This might be all much more complicated than I thought. Anyway, if I can survive all this, then I can definitely get on with my house and building. It's gonna be really cool. Friends, as you can see, I started to heat up very quickly. I need to cool myself down again. It will always be basic if I want to keep building a house here. This will be my problem. I have to keep putting ice on, keep pouring liquids, and keep myself cool. It's going to be difficult. JJ, I can see you're having some difficulties. Maybe you should just give up and stay out of it. It could really hurt you in the long run. You don't want to be destroyed, do you? I'm not giving up that easy, Mikey. No matter how much you want to scare me, I'm going to keep building my house inside your furnace. Uh, I have to. I'll fight your monsters. I'll be able to cool myself and the whole house down. It'll be easy enough. Anyway, I will destroy you really, really fast, just like all the monsters. I'm going to win this battle. Good. Whatever you say, then the heat is at maximum. 
I'll burn you 100% and do my best to win. You'll never be able to build a house or even something here again. I'll work my limit. You won't be able to do that because you yourself will be an incredible pain then. It's only a temporary reinforcement. If I can survive this, then I'll win. I will truly destroy you. I feel like each of us can solve all the problems as quickly as possible. But you can't solve the problem with me. You'll have to keep living like this with a house inside you. Do you understand, Mikey? I'll definitely find a way to just take you down. It's only a matter of time. So just wait a little while. Whatever you say. I don't think there's anything you can do to me. It's just not going to be realistic. I'll just destroy everyone around me and finish my cool house inside the furnace. I'll just need a lot more time, and I'm hoping to solve all the problems as quickly as possible. Each of us is really doing something incredible. I want to solve all the problems and see it through to the end. Anyway, we're really one step away from solving everything. I want to try to really realize it all. I feel like this is really the last step of our whole story, so we should be able to solve everything pretty quickly. Anyway, the sooner we get it all done, the better it will be. I hope your house burns down. I don't want to have a whole house inside me. It's just going to be unbelievably bad. Oh no, it's just gotten incredibly hot for me. I'm starting to take a lot of damage. I just need to solve this whole thing as quickly as possible and put myself out. I don't want to burn that badly. The villager took his meat and now I just need to cool down a bit myself. I won't be able to hold this kind of heat for very long. I don't want to solve all these problems this way. I just want to fall into the water and put myself out. That would really be the right thing to do. So it turns out you've given up? I want to solve all these problems as soon as possible and get it over with once and for all. Yes, JJ, you've won. I can't fight you and you proved you can do it. I'm going in the water. You can build yourself a house there. Do whatever you want. Anyway, I can't stop you anymore. yoo -hoo, we did it. I really got what I wanted. Now it's cooler here and I can build my house in peace. JJ was able to beat me after all. I give up, friends. Let him do what he wants. Like I said before, we were able to beat Mikey. It was tough, but we did it. Now I can do more mundane things now that it's not so hot in here. Now I can solve all the problems as quickly as possible and get them over with soon. Anyway, I just have to finish the interior of the house and I can say that my house is ready. We're each doing everything to the max. I just want to keep doing it all and really enjoy some of the little things. Each of us are really doing our best in our battle. Mikey wants to destroy me and I want to build a house. I'm really curious to see which of the two of us will win this battle. After all, it's going to be very difficult. Don't think it's that easy. You fought really well against me. I really tried to destroy you. That's the only reason I stepped back. I couldn't take the heat myself and decided to give up. You prepared well. Because I knew this would happen. That's why it's only a matter of time before my house is built. We can solve everything quickly enough. I will make the best house here, improve it and make it bigger. I just need a little time for that, as I think I can realize everything very quickly and win this battle. That's the most important thing right now. Anyway, the sooner we get it all done, the better it will be. I hope we can build everything in time. I won't get in your way. I'll just watch you build houses here. I'm curious to see what you'll get at the end, too. You'll still get involved from time to time and just try to destroy me, won't you, Mikey? Is that a trap of yours, too? I can't control it all that well, but yes. I will work and raise the temperature sometimes. So you're going to have to really adjust to that and see the problems, because I want to just stop you. I realize you're not very happy with where we are inside, but what can you do? I just want to build my new home here because you destroyed my old one. It's just a big desire to really do what you want to do. My house will help me in all my business. Anyway, I'll get it all done and finished pretty quickly. It's just a matter of time. If no one gets in my way, I'll get it all done quickly and there won't be any problems. I'll be doing the farm and building a house. I told you that you've won now. You can do literally anything you want. Just don't destroy me and my furnace. Fine. Whatever you say, Mikey, that's really enough for me to solve all my problems as quickly as possible. It's just a matter of time. I'm just gonna take you down. That'll be quick enough. I hope we can win. Anyway, each of us is really preparing for battle. I hope it's for a reason. We'll fight you more than once. I'm more than sure of it. But you won't destroy my house again. I'll do my best to cool it down, and you definitely won't be able to solve this problem, no matter how hot you get. Apparently, I've lost everything I can. That's what my problem is. I can't go all the way to the end and protect my interests. You're my friend, and I still let you build a house here. I just had no choice. 
That's why you continue to be here. Exactly. You can't beat me because it's just not realistic. I want to build a better house than I had in the village. That way, I can definitely live inside your house and not have any problems. I'll just have to get out once in a while. Will I have to be a furnace all the time? That's just unbelievably awful. I only wanted it for a while. I didn't think of that for some reason. That could really be a problem if you want to turn back. Then I'll just leave the furnace as it is and separate from it. It'll be very, very easy. That's a great plan. Then you can live normally and my house will stay in the oven forever. Everybody's on the plus side. Good. Then that's exactly what we'll do. I'll get out of this stove a little later and we'll think about what to do. Great. I'm almost ready. I've cooled down my house and it's going to be really, really fast. Now I want to do the extension and then we'll cook everything for sure. It's going to be unbelievably cool. Here's your rock, JJ. Keep on keeping on building your house. It's really interesting. We have to really solve all the problems and see it through. It's going to be just incredibly cool and interesting. I've got a really big job ahead of me, so I want to finish it as soon as possible and finally get a break from all this. So friends, goodbye everyone. I'll see you all very soon. <laughs>